brothers and sisters. When you call out to Allah, what should you do? First thing you do, seek forgiveness. You want to ask Allah something, what should you do? Ask Allah to forgive you first. Because imagine I've done so much bad to you and then I come and say, brother, I need to borrow 10,000 pounds urgently. Please, it's a matter of life and death. And you look at me and think to yourself, this guy has been the worst person that they could ever have been in my life and such a big pain. And today he's coming to me. Surely if he started off by saying, listen, brother, I know I've been a real pain in your life. I know I've done so much of bad against you. I've said so much of rubbish about you behind your back. I've done so much. I've caused you a lot of loss. I really, really want you to forgive me today. I'm desperate. I need 10 grand. If he's an extremely loaded guy, I'd say, brother, don't worry about all of that. You know, yesterday, a youngster comes to me. May Allah grant him goodness in Jannah. Because he had the guts to do what he did. He comes to me and he tells me, Sheikh, I need to talk to you just for 30 seconds. Now, that's not easy. But I said, no problem. You know, sometimes you've got to look at the situation. I was about to leave. And he says, I've said a lot of stuff about, I said, stop there. Everything is forgiven. Because I know what he wants to say. I've said a lot of stuff about you. That's not good. And I want you to forgive. Before you even ask me, I want to tell you two things. And this youngster must be a teenager, a little bit beyond. Listen, my brother. It's all forgiven. And if you ever have to do it again, do it again. Did you hear what I just said? Whatever he said has not affected me. Maybe it's what he said that caused me to achieve what I have from Allah. So I don't mind you doing it again, bro. If that was the ingredient that made my cake, I need another cake exactly like that one. So if you dropped in a little bit of mm, the secret ingredient, let it be. Subhanallah. Let it be. 